Hello everyone, um, so what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be learning how to do that animated intro which is always at the start of all our two channel teach videos. Um, as you saw in the preview, uh, well actually the preview was actually the intro which is what we're uh, doing today. So uh, as you saw in the intro we're going to we're gonna have a black background but before we do that we're going to change the layout of blank so we've just got blank slide. Path direction, and you'll 
see it comes on like that, right? We're gonna set the duration to, uh, let's say, um, let's just take 0.2, right? It's gonna be really fast. Um, and we're going to do the same for this one, except we're gonna go back down, more motion fast, and we're going to take, um, we're going to just take, um, let's take down, right, for example, right? And for this one, we're gonna have to go this way. And you see, um, if I go, go, go zoom in again, you see you've, you've got this dotted line and it has to li line up with the outline of the, of the two trams, so, let's do that, so it needs to go off the screen, and it's now lining up perfectly, right, so, set the duration to that, to 0.2, and we're going to make it with previous, and if we go to uh, an animation pane, we're going to select the top one and go with previous as well, play it all, it goes like, oh, sorry, do something. Um, I need to do the two chams and uh, make it a reverse path direction like before, so it comes on that way. So now if we play all the goes like that, right? Now what we're going to do is we're going to copy and paste that, and we're going to create a line, right? So we're just going to draw this line in the middle of the two chams, and as you'll see, as you have seen, um, the, the two chams, this, this side here, comes up a bit, right? This, this line in the shape format tab, shape outline white. We're going to make the weight, let's say, um, let's just use, uh, let, let's go, let's go quite, quite thick. So let's go f six, right? Maybe actually four and a half. Um, and we're going to just move this, this um, slightly to the side, right? And then we're going to move these our arrow keys to just move it. So, um, we can move this in a bit and just snap to that. Now we've got the right um, sort of thing here, we can actually move this up a bit with the line. Go up and then to the side a bit. Right, it just makes it more animated, so we can move that back down. Um, now we're going to go to transitions. We've, we've used this morph transition before, if you've seen in my other videos. We used it in the, the subscribe animation, and if you haven't checked, the, checked that out in the, in the, in the corner, um, it's a really good animation to just show you how to do a subscribe gif. But anyway, we're going to use this morph transition, which just moves everything into uh, into one direction. You'll remember that this line comes on from the side, so what you need to do is you need to um, copy it into the first line. But before we do that, we want to make sure that this this um, duration of the of the, of the, of the transition is um, 0.2 as well, so it's quite fast. So if I just play that again, it's like that, right? Now let's copy and paste this. Copy, paste. Down next to this green line, in line with it, right? Around there, let's say. Right, let's move that down a bit because it can't be touching the green line. Now, if we go back here, the transition is like that, right? Um, and then we just copy this tab again, right? And then we're going to make. We're just going to go like that, right? And we've, we're just going to delete all the animations and we're going to make another morph, right? Right? Um, and this time, we're going to make the uh, again this duration is going to be 0.2 uh, but we're going to move this two trams in until it, it, it like aligns with it so you're going to have to move it again, right and you've got the, the what's it called the, the half of the, the other half of the two trams aligned with it so that it actually um, it actually like you can actually read it without space in between so uh, we go back to transition let's click on more so that's what the more um, and now the teach um, and the teach like um, what's it called the teach the, like the teach text box which we're doing because it's going to say to trans teachers so that's on our channel um, uh, so this um, this will also be a Highland Gothic FLL because I just like the font um, but you, you, you just choose whatever you font you like um, then we let's just make a text box and we're going to write teach in it, right? And let's just make that highly gothic as well. And then we're gonna just make that a bit bigger. Okay, and then let's just make that 54. Yeah, it's a good size. Actually, maybe a bit bigger, like that. So it's just gonna go underneath the two chance. Um, we're gonna start 
it off uh, um, around under the two champs. It doesn't look very good right now, but I, I promise you it will. So let's just send that to back. And then we're going to put that animation of the lines. Right, and it's going down. We don't want it to go down that much. Uh, hold the shift button so that it doesn't move. Uh, from like it doesn't go go like horizontally. And let's just put it uh, under the two shots there. Right. Okay, that doesn't look very good right now. So what we're going to do is we're going to make a box. Choose a box and just make it go in there. Make the, the shape fill black. Shape outline, no outline. Turn this back once, twice. like layering so we've got this this box that's just here and let's just let's, let's just move this bit up right and it basically means we can see that, that you don't see the teeth but then you can see it when it comes out at the bottom so um let's just change the the length of this to point um point five i think right um that's that's good so it's just going to go like that right now if we play the slideshow we've got things like this it goes like that and it goes like that right but we're not done yet because we need to go back to transitions and make it after zero, after zero, right? It just means um, I don't need to press anything when it's playing, so let's play again, and that, that's a lot more smooth. So thank you for watching. If you haven't um, already, please subscribe. It would really help us out. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and share on this video, um, and yeah, I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching.